Yo, what's up? So, we're going to be doing a Red Dead Redemption 2 camp members tier list. Now, I wanted to do this because I was scrolling through YouTube, uh, watching some Pete Davidson uh, highlight clips, and uh, I found a community post by a channel called Red Dead Clips. Pretty good channel. I watch a lot of their clips. Um, and they made a camp member tier list, okay? And in my personal opinion, which is the only opinion that matters, <laughs> um, it fucking sucks. Let me just read you this list here. Leopold and Molly in the awful slash absolute shit tier. Uh, we have bad tier. We have Jack, uh, Karen, Pearson, Grimshaw. Uncle. What the fuck? Good slash decent. You have Abigail, Josiah, Lenny, Sean, uh, Tilly, Mary Beth. And then in the great tier, you have Bill, Javier, uh, what's her fucking name? What's her 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 name? Um, uh, I'm, I don't know why, but I'm forgetting, like, all of the characters' names. Hold on. Um, uh, what the fuck is her name? Dude. It's like the one. The one. You know? The one. The one character. Bro, what the fuck? Why do I forget their names? Oh my god. I have memory issues or something. Um. Bro. Why can't I remember her name? Like, this is awful. Dog. What the fuck is her name? She's literally one of the main characters. Sadie. What the fuck? <laughs> Sadie's in great tier. And then Reverend Swanson. Legend is Dutch. Charles. Hosea. Micah. God tier is Arthur and John. <sighs> I'm sorry. But I saw this list and I thought, no. You know? Um, so I'm going to be doing my own ranking. And we're just going to start off. We're just going to go like this. Okay. Um, so Abigail. Decent start. Um, Abigail, I think, is a decent character. Um, she's not. She definitely doesn't get much uh, light. She doesn't get much showtime in RDR2. And I'm just going off of RDR2, by the way. Well, no, RDR1 counts too. If they're in RDR1, I will count them in that. Um, but focusing on whatever. And Abigail doesn't get much, like, showtime in, uh, 2. She actually does oh, she gets a decent amount of time in 1. And she gets a lot of time in Epilogue. And she was overall pretty good or decent character. Um, Arthur, obviously the protagonist of the second game. Um, his actor won a... Game Award, I think it was. I forget what it was. I think I think it was um uh best best actor in a video game probably. Um, I personally love Arthur. A lot of people say he's overrated, but I absolutely loved playing as him. Uh, love his character. Love him. 
great character, great character arc, great design character. Bill. Now, Bill is in the camp for the uh, second game, and then he's one of the main villains for the first one. Um, Bill, honestly, a, a lot of people love him. I think he's just okay. Like, definitely wouldn't go down here, but I'd put him in, like, uh, good or decent. Charles. Charles. Now, I'm, I'm going to reserve God tier for the main characters, I guess. Um, you know what? Just Arthur. Just Arthur goes there. Uh, now, Charles. I'm just going to put him in his rightful place. Legend. Absolute fucking legend. One of my favorite characters. He's definitely, like, one of the most, like... He's, he's simultaneously one of the chillest, coolest members of the group. And then also just a hulking, like, menace at the same time. Like, you would not want to get into a fight with Charles. He could probably beat anybody's ass in this entire list. Besides, like, maybe Arthur. And even then, he'd probably still win. Dutch. Dutch is a, a complicated man. He starts off as the absolute leader of the group and then turns into the biggest villain in the entire series. Um, I gotta put him in Legend tier. You gotta put him in Legend tier, right? It's fucking Dutch Vanderland. He, uh, he's the only reason that these people are all together, really. Well, for the most part. Hosea played into it, but, you know... He's one of the fuck. He's the guy. That's the the uh, the guy. That's the guy. Uh, Grimshaw. Great character, I'd say. Great character. A lot of people do not like Grimshaw. I personally thought she was great, especially towards the end of the game. I thought she was great. Excuse the train. God damn it. God damn it. Excuse that. I live... Excuse that. <laughs> um, Hosea, absolute legend. I fucking love Hosea. He was awesome in that game. Um, I absolutely wanted to see more of him. His death left me so fucking sad, bro. I hope if they ever do a Red Dead Redemption 3... That it's focused on Jose as the main character. Because that would be awesome. That would be awesome. Um, Jack. Now this is going to be about Jack as a character overall. So from little, little guy Jack to big man Jack. You know, big man. Miss you're making my hormones act up Marston. <clears throat> Honestly, I'd say great character. Um, his little kid version is great. Um, adorable. His uh, preteen character um, was kind of annoying, but most preteens are. His teenager character was better, but still kind of annoying. Was, was he better? I can't really remember. Um, still annoying. Teenagers are. Um, his adult character was okay. Up. Uh, no, I'll, I'll put him in great. I'll put him in great. Javier. Sort of controversial opinion here. I fucking love Javier. A lot of people hate Javier. I fucking love Javier. I, oh, I loved him in the first game, and he's not even a character that betrayed you. Well, he kind of did, but he also didn't. You can tell that he didn't want to, it's just he was following Dutch because he's loyal to Dutch. Like, he's loyal to... He, he's too loyal, if you get what I'm saying. It's not like he wanted to go against Arthur and John. it's just that he was loyal to Dutch, he owed Dutch. And in the second game, I don't know, well, 
I get why he was an antagonist because you had to get to him to get to Bill. But I don't know why people hate him. Like, I really don't get it. There's nothing to hate. The most that he ever did, even in Red Dead 1, he, he said he doesn't want to fight you and then runs away from you even though he's a fucking bounty hunter for the Mex Mexican government and can honestly probably take John on in a fight. He didn't because he didn't want to. The worst this guy has ever done to any of the main characters is saying, I hope you rot in hell to John after he fucking beat him up and uh, picked him up, tied him up and fucking threw him in a prison cell. Come on. John. I'd say legend. I don't like him as much as Arthur, but John is still an amazing uh, main character. For sure. Amazing main character. Should I put him in God tier? Yeah, I'll put him in God tier. I, I feel like that's fair. You know, they're the two main characters. You kind of got to put them there. Uh, because they are amazing main characters. Not everything has a good main character. And you can honestly probably in some shows or games rank them last. But Red Dead does not slack in their main character department. Josiah Trelawney. Uh... I wouldn't put him in legend tier, but I'd put him in great tier. I love Josiah. Um, I love his his style. I love his voice. Um, he's actually a super smart schemer when it comes down to it. Like that that fucking uh, boat mission with the like gambling and shit. That shit was big brain as fuck. Like this man is smart. That's a smart man. Karen. I'm going to put her in bad tier. I know a lot of people like Karen, but I, I just, I mean, she had her good moments, like, uh, when she did the acting thing and the bank heist and, you know, just being a part of that bank heist and doing a good job at it. I thought that was a good part, but the rest of it is kind of annoying because she's just kind of always pissed off or drunk in the later part of the game. And it's like, eh, you know. <clears throat> Lenny, absolutely love Lenny. I fucking love Lenny. Oh my fucking god, dude. The the one where you go up to the, uh, I think the Lemoyne Raiders at, um, the one plantation house, and he fucking, like, goes up to them and is talking about, <laughs> he comes up to them talking about fucking God and the Bible and shit, just trying to distract them. That shit is so funny, dude. Lenny's a, a, an amazing character, and definitely gives some insight on what it was like uh, uh, back then. You know, the whole political tension thing. He really, uh, his discussion with Arthur about it, I, I really liked. Um, Mary Beth, uh, I'd put her in good or decent. Um, Mary Beth's a good character, but she doesn't really go past that. She doesn't do anything to be an extraordinary character or anything. She's just good. Good character. Nice person. Micah. <sighs> Micah. As a person. Shit. But Micah as a character. <sighs> I hate, I hate putting him there. I hate putting them there. I, I gotta express that I, I, this is against my will, <laughs> putting him there. But you have to, they designed such an eve like a fucking perfectly evil person to hate this fucking much. The fact that I hate this character that fucking much, that proves that that's a great character. That's all I have to say. Molly shit um she didn't do much <laughs> that's pretty much it <laughs> uh pearson eh. 
bad or good or decent, bad or decent, basically. Um, I'd say bad. I, I mean, no, because I dislike Karen, but I don't dislike Pearson. I just have like I'm neutral on him. Like I have zero opinion on Pearson, because you don't do much with him. He's just kind of there. But overall, he was good to the characters. He was a nice person. Uh, I'll put him in decent. Oh, he's a decent character. Sadie. Ah, I'm torn on Sadie. I'm really torn on Sadie. Um, when I played the game, I really liked Sadie. I probably would have put her in like great tier. But after playing the game and kind of looking back on it, she kind of sucks. I'll just put her in good tier. She's good tier. Um, Sean. I'll put him in great tier. I really like Sean. Um, you know, he was funny. He was annoying. I liked him. I liked him. His death, his death was shocking. I was like, like it was just like normal, and then boom! It's like, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> like that was fucked up. Leopold Strauss, shit, shit, like worst character in the fucking camp. Um, and you see, with Micah, I hate him the most. Strauss probably second most. But Micah's a good character, like, written-wise. Strauss is just a fucking scumbag. Like, uh... Swanson. Great character. Um, I always liked him. He had a, he had a style about him. And plus, I love, like, his character arc. How he, like, cleaned himself up and, uh... Was starting to be wise. You could see why he was a reverend. You know? And, like, his, um, dude, his fucking, uh, fire speech, fucking amazing. Look up Reverend Swanson, uh, what's, what's the speech called? Um, you have to love yourself a fire. That's what it's called. I think it's, I think that, I think that's what it's called. It's an amazing speech. Um, Tilly? Uh, I really liked Tilly. I thought she was great. Um, I wish we got more of her though. So I'm just I'm gonna put her in good. If we got more of her, I'd probably say great. But since we didn't, I'd put her in good. Um, Uncle God tier. I said I was gonna leave him to the main characters. I know, but Uncle. God tier. Uncle's God tier. Uncle is God. Okay? Okay? I don't know how he was in bad tier, I think, on his list. Uncle is an amazing fucking character. Like, sure, Arthur and John, gunslingers of the West, right? Uncle, though, roaster of the West. You cannot tell me in a roast battle that anybody in this camp would beat him. Closest one is Arthur. I'd say Arthur, uh, fucking Hosea, mm, probably Sean, uh, and yeah, those would be the roasters, but Uncle tops all of them, bro. And plus, there's a theory that he's fucking Jack Harlow. He's Jack Harlow. The main character from Red Dead Revolver, which was the first Red Dead game. And he's one of the greatest gunslingers in the West of all fucking time in the Red Dead world. Um, it's a theory, which I like to believe. It's probably not right, but, like, it's probably not right, but I like to believe that it is. Because it makes Uncle cooler. Um, and even, even then... He's still a good shot, still a good character, 
even now. So, just imagine him when he was younger. Um, but yeah, that's my list. Um, yeah. Bye. Uh, have a, have a good one. Have a good day. Have a good day. Be a good person. Be, be good. Okay, bye.